touching the ground every time. So yeah, so this is the bench clean. Um, it's kind of em uh, reminiscent of like a muscle clean with a barbell where you're not pulling back underneath like in a power or a full catch position. Pretty much eliminating the use of the hamstrings so you have to use more powerful tips and engaging the upper back musculature more. Mostly the lats are the big thing. You want to have a good hinged over deep torso drop. Pretty much like you're still doing kettlebell work, but the bells will be slightly behind you, and you have to aggressively pull back through. And once you hit this position, you're rowing the elbows back and punching through into a tight back position. So when you're here, I like to have the bell angled back to you to get a little bit of a rotation. So they start here, and when you come up, if you go slow, it's kind of a curl motion. But what you really want to do is be jacket through here so you come through and it gets you into a nice strong square position. Now when you're doing this as assistance to like strong upper back you can sit your clean like this as opposed to like a traditional catch here. Boom, rolls off back, pull the elbows, pull the elbows, pull the elbows. It's that row and push. Amazing. You don't think about having your hands come to here and you push your hands in the corners of the belt. You awesome. still feel your hamstrings and stuff like that, but it's a great upper back builder and just uh, working the hinge from a different eliminated position. High five. Love you, man. <laughs> <laughs>